we looked at our big community book and talked a lot about what makes a community and the people and places within our community at preschool and around our homes. We also talked about holiday happenings, outings and adventures with our families. We asked the children what they knew about keeping safe and what they would like to find out. We read road safety stories like Don't Forget the Cheese Pa and talked about how holding hands with a grown up is the best way to keep safe when we are out walking. community made from collage material. In small groups we thought about where the cars would go on the community map and where the people would cross safely. To extend on the learning we introduced technology by using the iPad to create stop motion clips so we could show the cars and people moving around safely. The children created some amazing road safety videos. We used the car seat chart to see which type of seat the children sat in. The children measured their heights to check they were the right size for the car that the seat that they were using. They learned that they won't be well protected by an adult seat belt until they were at least 145 centimetres tall. For the Kids in Traffic project we focused on our bodies, questioning, investigating and researching how we keep our bodies safe in the car near the road and on our bikes and scooters. We learnt about what's inside us, our organs, bones, blood vessels and how they work. We then related this information to ways we keep protected and safe like using the right size car seat and seat belts and wearing helmets. The seat belt goes over your strong hip bones and your ribs and your shoulders. It holds you in your seat safely. The thigh bone. Thigh bones connect to the hip bone or the pelvis. The hip bones connected to the back bone. The back bones connected where's our seat belt going to go? I can't go my soft tummy. The children learnt that the seat belts need to cross the strongest parts of their bodies, their bones. That their organs are inside their bodies and are protected by these strong bones. What does the bone protect? Your organs. Uh, names bone? about organs. Heart, lungs. Oh, we have to protect our brain wearing helmets. They learned how their organs keep them healthy and alive and that we should protect our organs from any damage. Everyone drew life-size pictures of their body to see just where all the organs and bodies are. We place seat belts over the drawings to see how the seat belts protect our bodies. The seat belt on your person, what? on your body, how your seat belt goes in your car. Oh, I'm gonna show that. You see what part of your body it protects. This is the way my, my seat belt goes. You've got two, one comes here, one yeah. comes here. The children found out how important it is to be in the right seat for their age and size and to make sure they are always buckled up properly on every trip. <laughs>